some ladies also get married to superstar because they have something to benefit from that but if you are taking it almost at a very lower class level whereby there's nothing attached to it just meet this lady because she's beautiful or because she can raise a family with me understand mm -hmm. you just look at the lady oh she has what i need okay that is the physical attraction you understand okay, yeah. whether bbl or natural you just have to keep yourself look good okay because yeah, when i'm seeing you in the first time I'm not seeing your brain. I don't know what is inside. I'm not seeing your heart. I don't know how good it is. I see your beauty. That's right. You just have to look good. Okay. You understand? Yeah. Be natural or be BBL. Mm -hmm. Then now another choice now becomes like, oh, I am a team natural. I'm not going to deny that. So on the next one, we're talking about the numbering of humans. I don't know if you guys have seen those videos. Rate us one through ten. I say you're like a like a nine. I think you're like a million. I appreciate yeah, it. Man. Thank you. Broke the scale. I know. I've passed. I was like, I want that. Damn. <laughs> Just being honest. Yeah. Oh, I appreciate. I go after it. what I want. Okay. Rate my boy. Uh, I say you're like an eight. I'll say an eight. Too. eight yeah. 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 All right. Question. What would you rate yourself? Uh, I rate myself like a nine. Yeah. I agree. A nine. Based on. You rate me. Do you actually want RA? I do. Okay. Objectively, I rate, I say six and a half. Rate this girl on a scale of one to ten. I guess six, six and a half, seven on a good day. She said ten. These girls got a lot of confidence these days. <laughs> rate yourself. Uh, I give myself like a five or six. I'm a modest fellow. Others would agree? Probably. Let's find out. Rate this guy on a scale of one to ten. Seven. Rate yourself. Like a seven? You're confident in that? Yeah. Others would agree? Maybe. Let's find out. Trying to be convincing like that. I give it a 10. Did you get her socials? What did you get? Listen, this is my city. I'm valid. But she's valid. Don't get me wrong. From Miami too? What are you talking about? I had to get My thought about this is how did we get here that we have to start numbering ourselves to suit or to be looked upon like we are beautiful? Because from seven to 10 is you're very attractive and beautiful. Mm -hmm. Then from five below, or from six below, you are not it. So I'm just like, how did we get here as humans? What's your name? Charlie. What would you rate this girl on a scale of one to 10? I would say, um, let me preface, I have a girlfriend, she's a 10. Yeah, I mean, she's pretty, she's active, she's got a lot of friends, seven or an eight. I'm into fitness and she seems relatively fit. Then what will make her a 10? I would never give anyone a 10 besides my Sophia. What would you rate this guy on a scale of one to 10? Oh, he's, he's really cute. Is that a girlfriend though? <laughs> I like his hair, love dark hair, great bod, super cute, adorable. 10 out of 10. Do you want to meet him? Sure. How's it going? Hi, I'm Caroline. Nice to meet you too. Charlie. Did the rating change after meeting in person? No. It stays the same. Would you guys exchange numbers? Uh, yeah. What do you rate yourself out of 10? Oh, like a 5 or 6. Do you think other people will agree? <laughs> yeah, maybe. I don't know. What do you rate this girl on a scale of 1 to 10? Sin City was a media. Um. She, she looks nice. I give her like a 7, 8. 7, 8. What do you rate yourself out of 10? Um. Say a 6. 6, why? Uh, you know. On a scale of 1 to 10, how beautiful do you think you are? I don't think that anyone can necessarily put themselves on a scale. <laughs> I wouldn't see myself as a fluid person. I, I'm never mind. I'm done. <laughs> oh, 10. Well, yeah, 10. I would say a 10 too, but honestly, my first thought was like, there's no ring. Because yeah. no one determines that. I would say the same. Maybe like an 8. A 9, maybe? Maybe like 5. Difficult question. It changes a lot. Right now, I'd say about a 6. How would I see a fellow human being as a 4? Just because they don't suit what... Um, my taste. The taste, okay. yes. Um... Uh, no, my own it's you asking the person um, <laughs> like how many percent uh -huh. is the person you understand uh -huh. and you're giving the person four because the person is not up to your test. Yeah. You that is giving the person four. Your own brother is at home. Mm -hmm. He's not even up to the person. Definitely. You understand? <laughs> he's not even up to the person. He himself like his own person is zero. Mm -hmm. Why the person is, you're giving him for simply means the person is even much more better than your brother <laughs> you understand mm -hmm. so now so now giving the person four or five or zero mm -hmm. for me it's nothing mm -hmm. 
you understand mm -hmm. we are all human beings definitely you get uh -huh. so god created us to be beautiful even if the person is ugly to be beautiful yeah you understand you are you and secondly you're um telling the person you're not up to my class definitely, definitely. now you guys telling the person you're not up to um um his class or you're not up to uh, my own class do you have the quality like do you have the quality of be to be rich are you rich no you're not rich you don't even have money and the person and you, you're telling the person you're not up to his class do you know how much is in the person's back account mm -hmm. you don't know so we don't just judge people by look. looks okay you get i would like to chip in something there right because i don't know how many billions of people are in the world right now but i will tell you it's less than one percent that will look good from when they were born ben, yeah. to when they die because we go through stress we go through different things that change people's looks over time i will tell you that for for the fact that there were times when i was really very sick because there was a time when i had um chronic um iron deficiency anemia especially if you have if you're someone that suffers from any blood disease it will affect the way you look even if you are a very very beautiful person you will just look at yourself and you you snap picture you come out like drawing you'll be asking yourself like what's <laughs> happening here you understand me yeah so i just think that numbering people because at that point when you're numbering that person you don't even know the stress that person is going, going through, through that has made the person's beauty to fade away because you will not tell me that this is how i've been looking from when i was born lie lie there were times when that even me i look myself and say hey when i snap picture i say hey. <laughs> <laughs> i will hide the camera like a plague because i know i'm not looking good even so, as a future i i think um, yeah and uh, that is disrespectful as far as i'm concerned yeah because you can't just say this person look one this person look two to yeah. understand from my own point no, of view no. disrespectful and then pictures actually works with time mm -hmm. there are some times whereby we look photogenic and sometimes we don't even sometimes the interest is not there mm -hmm. so even when you're taking the picture you're not going to look good mm -hmm. and then there are people that don't snap picture i could remember then i don't take picture mm -hmm. now, whenever i take picture i look awful to myself Definitely. Like, who am i you said understand then a friend of mine begins to tell me like continue taking it then you so because you are being conversate with camera mm -hmm. and then you look good on camera yeah, doesn't mean that other people that don't look on look camera on they are not good and then if if we think people are not good the idea of saying this one is one this one is two this one is three it's, i don't actually buy it as far as i'm concerned yeah i don't buy it from my own side let people be people let human be human let yeah. everybody just enjoy themselves mm -hmm. according to whoever they are mm -hmm. that just me so let me that, that those, those are very powerful points i think um the social media is really doing a lot of harm mm -hmm. recently right. because so many people so many people mm -hmm. are on social media for the wrong purpose yeah and that's why podcasts like this is mm -hmm. good mm -hmm. where we'll talk about discuss topics that will um change the minds of people okay numbering when you come out and you be begin to like do it comp this first of all you are you lack a sense of purpose mm -hmm. number two we should not people metamorphosize over time thank you That's i fun. don't look the same way i was last month definitely when i'm stressed when a little thing disturbs me mm -hmm. i, it, I in, in few days i, I cut down definitely. you know and so human beings need to come to an understanding mm -hmm. that you don't judge people based on the season or on yeah. how they look, look, yeah. look exactly. so you should not rate i'm a four maybe i'm a i'm a 20 over t i'm 100 mm percent -hmm. but just give me time mm -hmm. give that person time yeah. to make money to be Thank peaceful you. and you will see the real you beauty so a lot of people I, I like that a lot of people have made mistakes yeah. married the wrong ladies because yeah. they could not discern yeah they could not see far from the definitely. initial state you just see a lady i'm like she's broke i can't date who told you what is your definition of broke yeah we are all in process sure. many billionaires today were once very broke yes, many so wealthy ladies to be to, that they, they have a story mm -hmm. and look at their back features and now mm -hmm. so an intelligent person mm -hmm. will not first of all numbers pe number people, people yeah and second of all we as if you are being numbered you should not even feel bad about it because you're confident in yourself you're confident in your journey mm -hmm. and you know that you're still you're still evolving yeah, the best part of you is yet to emerge yeah definitely. so yeah
purpose and the you know people just have to change their mindset about all these things oh, okay yeah. uh, because so, i'll tell you for the fact i don't know where people are getting all these notions from i don't know if it's from the other podcasts because people will just sit in groups and send out some opinions that are not even i uh, from, when you that, want to, from that i think it's a matter of trend yeah when you want to just calculate it and put your head to it mentally it is it's off yeah because you and some people would pick up those things and go with it that oh i want just a lady that looks a 10 yeah. just a, a lady that looks a nine just a lady that looks this a lady that looks that have you thought about 10 years down the line five years down the line if that person will still be the same Absolutely. you've never you don't even have Absolutely. a clue so sometimes it's it's when i see the the videos oh she's a 10 i always go for 10s myself i'm a nine like seriously who told you and i beauty is the uh, the beholder i could be your beholder of your beauty and i'll tell you oh you look amazing and i could stand in front of another person and the person will just be like shit this is your rubbish let me add to just yeah. that was powerful you yeah. know some people people will speak like this mm -hmm. i need only a 10 or a 9 mm -hmm. they are egotistical in nature yeah, it's their definitely. ego they want to feed their ego yeah and when you make decisions based on your ego mm -hmm. you make mistakes definitely. so at the end of the day let's stop even blaming or saying women are all the same mm -hmm. men are all the same mm -hmm. let's start looking at our process of making decisions definitely yeah. because if you're saying that my wife must be a 10 over 10 ah, or my man know. must be if you are giving certain and you are not really paying attention to the things that mm -hmm. matter mm -hmm. you will take the 10 on 10 mm -hmm. and you will suffer the consequences of and have, and have the 10 on the 10, 10 over 10, 10 negative to deal with so thank when you, you come out don't say <laughs> women are bad men yeah, no it is you. what how do you choose yeah are you feeding your ego mm -hmm. or are you taking the right decisions for the right reasons definitely okay so let's get to the other one which is the battle of the sexes i will tell you for real this is something i don't know see the internet bought enlightenment and much more of it nowadays is like it's on a negative side because the opinions and things that are going on and on in the world today is just super crazy a bunch of ladies will sit and be vomiting rubbish will be telling other ladies how to treat a man bad oh you're not supposed to do this oh you're not supposed to do that and then a group of men sit in their own podcast vomiting crazy opinions oh a woman that does this a woman this is not this don't go for the women that are not good looking and some people pick it up and go with it i don't know it seems like negativity people just want to feed off negativity and so what do you have to say about this people sitting in bunch of, of 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 sexes like female and male podcasts and they are vomiting rubbish because attire especially there was one of these and i'm sure they're banned from youtube mm. it's called the the, the red peel where a bunch of guys sat down and they would rubbish women to the core like so and youtube had to take upon themselves to to, to stop it to stop, stop it, it because it was getting out of hand so what do you have to say about it so you know this there's a popular say that your network yeah. is your network thank you and association plays a whole lot okay it when it comes to life and destiny okay so i these people who find who have the time okay to sit down and discuss topics or plan evil or plan plot some kind of crazy things to mm -hmm. do to revenge i just it comes back to they lack a sense of purpose yeah. because if you're really busy if you are if you're conscious about um living a, a, a fulfilling a life that gives value yeah you will not have time to gather and want to give revenge or do some type of things you know all those kind of unnecessary gadgets they are not necessary definitely and i'll even chip in and this comes with the kind of friends that you keep around okay and that's why um uh, 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 she said uh, may made mention of you, at times you don't even need friends because there are these type of associations they mm -hmm. call themselves friends is mm -hmm. these gossips is mm -hmm. these plots mm -hmm. that is keeping their friendship strong okay and if you look at people who, who live that kind of a life mm -hmm. 
they don't really there's nothing to show for definitely they, that is literally their job yeah and that's no life okay i would like to chip in, in yeah. i would like to chip in something yeah. because I, I i said it one time when i was looking at those pot these people are so dysfunctional within themselves right. they are so broken within themselves that they don't want to feel that pain alone they want to spread it out correct because i don't understand how you just want to just come up with some things in your head if you don't have that brokenness in you you, you must have you, no, you must have no, a, no, a part no. of broken. i think uh, yeah. the whole world that is more community is, mm -hmm. is damaged that's the fact <laughs> yeah. Yeah. because every one of us now look at we need to make money mm -hmm. And then whatever it takes we just have to make money mm -hmm. and we don't care if what we are doing is actually affecting the community negatively definitely as come across a video yesterday night before i slept where some youtuber have to engage in some shooting they have to shoot themselves you understand yeah. and post it on youtube and then it's kind of a trend mm -hmm. you understand mm -hmm who attempt or make an attempt to kill himself just to hand money it doesn't sound well to me definitely you understand yeah but this is the community which we have mm -hmm. in the whole world in the whole world everywhere from north to south east to west yeah everybody are trying to do something crazy mm -hmm. just to entertain people mm -hmm. to hand money yeah and i think our world leaders have a lot of things to do to that. they shouldn't just Thank sit you. down and like oh Thank we are you. creating a democracy environment we are creating a freedom of speech or freedom of expression environment the freedom are going beyond what the future can comprehend yes so i think they have to sit down and have a large talk with a lot of these uh, media owners mm -hmm. and uh, regulate how we expose a lot of those stuff yeah because it's getting bad yeah that's why i was just before you chip in yeah, yeah. that's why i i really like this place the united arab emirates because they regulate certain things like right. exactly. you try it you are you behind are bars out, absolutely you you try it you are behind bars and i saw a time when they were posting when the flood happened and they were posting and they said don't post about the flood and everything and it was on the nigerian media space mm -hmm. and people were on the comment section uh, people need to have freedom of speech people need to i was like Yes, there is need for freedom of speech, but what are you sending out? Correct. What are you actually sending out? Because it's, because negativity hides be behind the phrase freedom Free of correct. speech. Correct. See, when it comes yeah. to freedom of speech, yeah. I was having a conversation with mm -hmm. uh, Paul the other time, mm -hmm. and then this happens to come in between. Yeah. When some stuff gets trained, mm -hmm it has some mental influence into people definitely and the people will react according to what they got into them definitely and that is the reason most governments have to find a way to regulate the way we express our freedom definitely. freedom of speech is not when you have an attempt to kill yourself <laughs> freedom of speech is not when you body shame some people forgetting ah. the fact that somebody is in the my attempt to commit suicide because mm -hmm. of what you just said yeah yeah you understand mm -hmm. so for me they have to regulate that we have to look for a way whereby we be our brother's keeper from what we sell out idea of making money on social media absolutely yeah. you know thank you so much for that you touched on this aspect of people just throwing whatever they want to throw on social media, media mm -hmm. as a method or a tool to trend yes so we are in a society where people as even celebrities mm -hmm. now believe that it is in negativity that you trend yes there's no one people are not uh, we don't have they are not being creative anymore. We don't have kingdom. We don't have celebrities that <laughs> believe that you can you can actually yeah, trend like, yes. in positive news. Yes. And so this is happening a lot. We have a lot of it's a strategy they are using now to come up with something negative mm -hmm. to trend. Yeah. But that is a sense of you you, you lack purpose because yeah. I always say that whatever we do without purpose is useless. Mm -hmm. It's either you're doing it because you want to 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 in, to impact. Mm -hmm. To, uh, a life positively or you Definitely. want there's, there's a message you want to pass out there Definitely. and that's why we are sitting here yeah so we don't have celebrities mm -hmm. or influencers mm -hmm. who um who are conscious of the fact that their influence okay. is for a purpose okay is to be able to influence people positively yeah so you don't just come out with a slang mm -hmm. or a uh, uh with a negative news mm -hmm. and you don't care the consequences on you the next 100 yeah. years just yeah. because yeah. you want to be popular so we think that's the, the thing staying relevant 
is by bringing up you know negative trends. but if you are a person of purpose you will always be relevant yeah definitely this is the mindset yeah, that, that, that we need yeah, so like right. you said leaders i think our leaders need to put in some rules and regulations, regulations just exactly. like dubai is doing where people don't just have the freedom of speech to say whatever but yeah I'm you saying, know or do whatever, or do whatever they, they, they want do to rubbish. do they do some rubbish it should come with heavy punishment and consequences and Definitely. that should stop mm -hmm. okay, and uh, yeah and bloggers as well should they should also place rules and regulations Regulation. on bloggers mm -hmm. bloggers should not just post anything, anything. because rules. they focus more on posting negativity Activity. to yeah. gain traffic than yeah. posting things that can influence people positively yeah. a lot of people have died because of social media ah, influence yes heart yeah. attack like mental video, health right, so yeah. mental health the is real make, um, video and it's it's, it's hap we should have more compassion mm -hmm. we should be more uh, uh, uh empathetical mm -hmm. in our communication That's online right. yeah. and everything so yeah. i think we hope that this message will reach some government leaders and uh, people Just in position where Definitely. they can be able to curb this normal this societal norms that is really killing our society Sorry, and also the citizens should be uh we hope that youths young people will ha start having a sense of purpose a sense of uh living a life not just speaking anyhow but yeah. doing things for a good cause yeah, yeah. definitely yeah. so mayor do you have anything to say oh, she said no. <laughs> oh, okay perfect okay so let's go to another one another trend I don't know if we are still doing that in 2024 because exactly. when I used to see it, my head is like, what's going on? Baby hair. This baby, <laughs> you will see people who snatch the baby hair. Bring it to the eyebrows. Eyebrows, my sister. I forgot and then we, which, which I one said, is baby hair? Ah, like brother, I don't know. Mostly, mostly this, uh, what, what do they call it? This um, wig mm, yeah. um, installation. Yeah. They will snatch uh, it. They bring okay. it to their eyebrows. I yeah. think that it is means, more common in the U.S. Most, even in, uh, even in Nigeria, U.S., even yeah. here, yeah. wherever. Why do you want to bathe? Simply, simply means if you want to take your bed, there's no how you can wash your face. I, I, I got into the metro one time and this girl has snatched it right up to her eyebrow and then she she carved the eyebrow so again and then plus makeup and then you know the heat here and then the whole thing was just so messy I don't really understand how they see it sometimes because me I hate the baby hair why would you have to snatch no no for me I think the baby hair is nice no nice. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. Do okay. not say that. <laughs> okay. No, I, 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 I think the baby nice. yes is it makes nice. Even if you do it, oh, it moderately, uh -huh. you understand. Uh -huh. If At least you do little. it moderately, you okay. understand. And then, from what I always say, ladies, you understand trend. Okay. You understand beauty. Okay. Beauty is different from trend, and mm -hmm. fashion is different from trend. Mm -hmm. There can be a fashion trend that is trendy that does not suit a certain person. Mm -hmm. You don't have to enforce that fashion trend on yourself. Such fashion trend, when you are wearing it at that time, it's not looking good on you. You look horrible. You understand? Yeah. If there is there are ladies that can do the baby hair mm -hmm. maturely and look nice, that's beautiful. It's okay. I, I don't have any problem with that as far as I'm concerned. But if you are doing it excessively or you don't understand your fashion sense, that might be another problem. Ah, so people will just do it eh, and then with the makeup, the thick makeup, and then when you sweat, it just <laughs> mix the whole thing. Your, your, your face or your look becomes a bono soup. Like, <laughs> like serious, no laugh, I beg. Like, I'm asking myself, what is this? Even if you don't have hair in front of your head like myself, please, I beg. No, so, you so look this, nice. This so, looks nice on you. This is natural baby hair. The, <laughs> 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 because of this, uh, no, I beg. That trend, I hope we don't do it in 2024. So what do you have to say, Mayo? Uh, for me, if you want to do the baby hair, I think you should just do it simple. You understand? Mm -hmm. You must not make it look so obvious like, ah, okay. If I should do it, I'll look so beautiful. You understand? Mm -hmm. So I prefer, I, I I would just say you should like do it so simple. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Oh, okay. So any last word on that, uh, Maria? I think, uh, baby, uh, if you do it and it looks good on you, then that's fine. Snatching it to your eyebrow. Your eyebrow. <laughs> anything <laughs> anything you that is exaggerated. Like, no, I think she said it right. Like, she yes. said simple. 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 Just, it just anything nice that is simple. an exaggeration is no more nice. So I think if we can just be moderate with whatever that we do. If it's like she said, 
you make it simple and if it brings out your beauty i i myself i put it when i used to still do you know hair, yeah. do hair <laughs> <laughs> so i love it because i think it also enhances your beauty a little bit okay. more but an exaggerated mm -hmm. drawing of it uh, it is does the opposite they of, will take it from here mm, to your to the eyebrow draw, that is the yeah. i was like yeah that is that is even stupid actually oh, so, that's stupidity. you've yeah. not seen it oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I will put a picture somewhere. That one, even, that one is even small. Well, how about here? You put they bring it down, down and, and then down. They, they make they zero here. Down. Like seriously, uh, Auntie, what are you doing? <laughs> they make zero, 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 and the whole face is just looking crowded. <laughs> like ah, it's swell though. So let's go over to another one. Me self. Hmm. These long nails and lashes that you enter by, you want to eat fufu, how do you eat? Because I just believe, okay, the nails, like myself, I'm putting on nails and it looks so nice. I know it does look nice. You're oh, looking yeah. at me, yes, it looks nice. But the truth is, I cannot put extra long nails because it, with this, I still struggle a lot yes. to put out my zip yes. to do things yeah. i really need to focus to yeah. do things my jewelries i cannot yes. even wear them yes. so talk less of the really very long ones hallelujah Amen. you would see people with some yeah. talents and you'll be like what is going on here <laughs> yeah. yeah and my mom one time would say i don't eat people's food like people who have very long nails yeah. when they cook it doesn't yeah. i i don't have the appetite yeah. to, eat. to eat because my question is as a lady with such long talents like extra long how do you cook how do you eat how do you wash yourself wash your private yeah. how yeah, let me see your name please this is mine it's normal i'll share a little story yeah. about my just this nails yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, syndrome they say too much of anything is a disease <laughs> as it's, and it's really true i was when i went for my beauty to do my beauty stuff and my nails i normally yeah. don't put nails mm -hmm. even this length for me yeah is long yeah yeah so it's like i want it short i want it not too long not, not too, too short medium and when i when she finished i was still seeing that it's, it's long. very long yeah. and truly it affects you yeah you want to do any little thing you know the bugger of it yeah when it's, it hits your bugger this way you, you don't know how to put it <laughs> <laughs> we inconvenience us. Oh, even though it looks beautiful, they say it looks sexy, but no, it looks, looks sexy. sexy. It, it looks good. Looks sexy. No, For this me, length. No, the long one. This length. The is long. Okay. No, I love yeah, this. this I, love, I, love, I love. I love. I love. the long one. How do you want two, to do you know, we, some, <laughs> we exaggerate. Sometimes we, we make your nails so long mm -hmm. that even and sharp. I see some nails that are long and then very sharp. Yeah. In the, they so want to become wolf link. So I did. don't. <laughs> <laughs> the, the bottom line, the, the, the truth of the matter is too much of anything yeah. is a disease. Let's just be moderate. Yeah. Yeah. Because those long nails, like. It's, it's, she said we're not something. trying to be judgmental. Yeah. It's a lesson for, for all of it. it yeah. yeah. She said something like, mm. how do you clean your ass? <laughs> Yeah, because it's true. How do you really clean your ass? That's what my mom was saying. They don't. Yeah. They don't. Yeah. Fella said they know the shit. Look <laughs> <laughs> my cut is, No, don't laugh. Bro. My cut is how do you clean your ass? Honestly, because that's what my mom said. Yeah. There are certain ladies with very long talons that she will never eat because the thought is they are cacas of course in your, of course, in your of nails course. You know, exactly. yeah they, they, they are That's cacas true. and it's when you how do you clean your because it's going to remain going in the nails to, yeah. and it, there's, there's, there's something it that doesn't make sense the, this lady um some sorry to say this but mm -hmm. there's this woman mm -hmm. i think she did uh this guinness world record okay. she has longest yeah, yeah. 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 And when i saw that i was like how do you how be this one is she wait does she beat like how, how does she, she beat yeah clean like Clean her body, yeah, rub her queen, exactly. clean her ass. That is too like, long. That's true. I'll go to the lashes because... No comments. In <laughs> You will Lip comment. Sealed. <laughs> no, you must comment though, because that's no, no, no. I'm not talking about yours is average. You understand? Yours is okay. See, I've had lashes on my eyes only once in my lifetime. Mm, and when, when I lashes on, okay. yeah, when I did it, 
I don't fix that like the the, the big one, but brisky eyelash. <laughs> Bro, do you want to fly? I think everything is it's okay. Somebody it's need a wing. Yeah. Like, if you want to do understand. beauty, you want to do your nails. Yeah. Do it. It's just the it's essence. What's the purpose? The essence of beautifying yourself is to look good yeah. and to look presentable and yeah. neat. Yeah. When when you when I watch people with nails well done, they look, you look neat. You yeah. look well.